Have you ever wondered what would happen if you fed your chickens only corn for one whole week? Well, I decided to try it. And the results, they might surprise you. Stay tuned, because by the end of this video, you'll learn the dangers of feeding just one type of feed, what chickens really need for health and eggs, and how you can create a cheap, balanced diet for your flock. Here's how I set up the experiment. For the next seven days, I removed every other feed. No greens, no kitchen leftovers, no formulated feed, just plain yellow maize, morning and evening. I used 15 local hens, three roosters, and a group of growers. Before the test, they were laying about six eggs per day. My goal was simple, to see how their body, behavior, and productivity would change after one week of only corn. On day one, they were excited. Chickens love corn. It's sweet, it's filling, and it's full of energy. The first two days, everything looked fine. They ate greedily, scratched around, stayed active. Egg production stayed steady at six eggs. At this point, you might think, wow, corn is enough. But wait until you hear what happened next. By day three, things started to change. Some hens were less active. Their combs that red crown on their heads began to look pale. Egg production dropped from six down to four per day. Why? Because corn is rich in carbohydrate, but very low in protein. And chickens need protein for muscle growth, feather development, and egg formation. Corn also lacks vitamins and minerals like calcium. Without calcium, eggshells become weak. So yes, the chickens were full, but they weren't nourished. Imagine eating only rice every day. You'll feel satisfied, but slowly your body will weaken. By day six, it got serious. Egg production dropped again. Only two eggs that day. And the shells, thin, fragile. The hands looked tired, feathers rough, the roosters less active. That's when I realized corn alone was starving them. This is the trap many farmers fall into, thinking one feed like corn is enough. Yes, it fills the stomach, but over time, it weakens growth, reduces aches, and can even lead to death. Uh, so what's the lesson here? Uh, chickens need a balanced diet. A single feed like corn can never be enough. Here's what their diet should look like. Energy sources, uh, maize, sorghum, uh, millet, cassava, uh, yams, protein sources, soya beans, groundnut cake, fish meal, termites, uh, even maggots. Minerals and calcium, oyster shells, crushed snail shells, limestone, uh, egg shells, and don't forget vitamins and greens, pawpaw leaves, moringa, vegetables, uh, kitchen scraps. When you combine these, you are not just feeding your chickens, you are fueling their health, their energy, and their productivity. If you want strong, productive chickens, uh, here are some practical tips. Mix corn with a protein source like soya. Always provide calcium for layers, add greens daily, they cost almost nothing, and rotate kitchen leftovers with greens. It saves money and keeps chickens balanced. Um, after seven days, I ended the experiment. Uh, I gave them a balanced diet again, and within days, egg production started climbing back. Uh, lesson learned, uh, chickens love corn, but corn alone cannot sustain them. So farmers, if you want your flock to thrive, uh, give them balance, variety, and care, and they'll reward you with more eggs, better growth, and higher profits. If you enjoyed this experiment, uh, hit the like button, uh, subscribe for more farming insights, and tell me in the comments, uh, what's the strangest thing you've ever fed your chickens?